Hello, I'm Dr. Stuart Flanagan. I'm an NHS doctor who works in the media, and today I'm going to give you some medical advice. So today we're going to talk about how to get rid of hiccups, which is an extremely common problem for lots of us. And hiccups are caused by the contraction of the diaphragm, which is a large sheet of muscle which sits below the lungs. And when it contracts, the little flap at the top of our windpipe, the glottis, shuts closed. And that's where we get the hoop sound from. And it's thought to go back millions of years, actually to our ancestors who first came out of the sea and had little gills that shut closed. And it's thought to be a primitive reflex that we've carried on all of those years. So it's likely that human beings have been hiccuping for far longer than we could possibly imagine. So what can we do to stop hiccups and kill them in their tracks? Well, first of all, it's important to remember that most hiccups are self-limiting and actually they run their course for a few minutes and totally stop by themselves. But some of the strategies that we use actually look at the science behind the hiccups. And it's thought that they reduce the level of carbon dioxide in our blood. And carbon dioxide is something that can reduce irritation of the phrenic nerve. And the phrenic nerve is the main nerve that innervates or powers the diaphragm, that sheet of muscle behind our lungs. So some of the strategies we use look at things which increase the carbon dioxide in our blood and reduce the effect on the phrenic nerve. Now the most common of those are things like standing on our head or holding our breath or drinking through a cup upside down. And all of these can help to increase carbon dioxide levels, but a few have actually been studied under scientific circumstances and uh, looked at more rigorously. And I'm gonna talk about some of those now. The first of them is to take a very deep breath and then to take a super maximal breath on top of that and to hold that for about five seconds or so and then take a super, super maximal breath on top of that again and hold that for five seconds and then breathe normally. And that has been found to try and, and that has been found to terminate hiccups completely. It's thought that that works by increasing a positive pressure in our airways and also by ceasing diaphragmatic innervation and increasing our CO2 levels. Another strategy which does some of the same effects is to close over the little flaps on your ears and then to drink a glass of water through a straw very, very quickly. And what that does is again, increase positive pressure in our airways and our lungs, and it can help to cease hiccups completely. You can try a few of your own strategies at home, but those are ones that have actually been scientifically tested. If your hiccups persist and last for more than a few days, it's important that your doctor checks them out and thinks of other causes and other reasons why you may, may be hiccuping for such a long time. They can also think of some other treatment strategies which may help for you. So that's some of the ways we can get rid of hiccups.